This is a wireless lavalier microphone and I'm not even gonna try and pronounce the brand name, but there it is. Okay, let's have a quick look around the box. Yep, so live show, interview, vlog, short video, great. On the side here, starting from the top. So this one, this um, colored there, this one is for an Android device, which I should be using this on. And you can also purchase them uh, just for iPhones. Okay, and at the bottom here, so this one is uh, just one-to-one, -one, which is perfect for me. And for example, let's say you're interviewing someone, then the bottom option will be ideal for you. All right, let's move on to the back, see what we've got. Yep, so yeah, plug and play. Yeah, 20 meters of accessible reception. Yep, blah, blah, blah. Okay, yeah, great. All right, I think that's pretty much it. So let's get inside this box. Oh, just before we do, just so you know, it is really well sealed. So perfect. Inside the outer packaging was this small black box, which contains the following. Starting off with the user manual, which is in a few different languages. And before we go further, I do have to say, I really like this presentation. All right, so here we have this here, taps in the end, and then we have the Click on microphone and obviously that's for the USB. And then in here we have the Type C to USB cable. Okay, so let's have a look, pull out the uh, Type C. Oh wow! Oh, this is a nice touch. You get a pouch, which is perfect, especially if you're transporting these three parts. Yeah, perfect. And for me, it is ideal because the purpose of purchasing this wireless lavalier microphone is so that I can use it out on location. Yeah, while smartphones are great, the microphones on smartphones are great, but when you start to move away from the device, you lose the sound quality. So this is, this is perfect. All right, so there's the cable itself there. In terms of price, this cost me 22 pounds from Amazon. When it comes to the clip, you can adjust it to suit your needs because it does rotate 360 degrees clockwise and anti-clockwise. The only downside with this clip is that this part here is not long enough and as a result, it tends to fly out of my fingers. In addition to that, when it comes to the receiver, you do have the option of charging it right here. To test how effective this wireless lavalier microphone is, I'm going to conduct two tests. The first one would just be using the microphone within this smartphone. And for the second test, I will be using this wireless lavalier microphone. Each test will be at five yard intervals. And at that point, I will count to five. The volume levels on all tests will be at maximum and the sound will not be edited in any shape or form. Trust me, I am no sound technician to know how to tweak the sound. Oh, and by the way, I would highly recommend at this point not adjusting the volume levels on your device so you can determine if there's a difference. With that said, let's go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, I decided to end the test there as you can barely hear my voice and under normal circumstances you would have clicked off the video due to the poor sound quality. Now let's have a look at the second test. One, two, three, four, five. 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 One, two, three, four, 
five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I got one more test using the wireless lavalier microphone, and that is to see if it works with my back turned to you. So let's give it a go. Yep, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Ta -da. Based on my test results, the wireless lavalier microphone is a hit, especially for amateurs like myself who are not sound technicians and just want something simple. Also, at that price, I cannot complain. And it exceeded the advertised range of 20 meters, which is fantastic. It is also good to use with social media platforms. If needed, do make sure you select the microphone within the settings menu of your camera app. I have been using the microphone across two continents and it has not let me down once, which is a ringing endorsement. When charging the microphone, it will be orange in color. And once it is fully charged, which is not very long, the orange light will disappear and will last you a few hours before needing to recharge. Also, before use, do remember to always turn on the microphone at the bottom red by pressing on it once. Then the light should be green, meaning you are ready to go. I cannot tell you the amount of times that I made that mistake of not turning on the microphone. And then I always wondered why I could not hear the sound when I replayed the footage. Well, that pretty much wraps up for this episode. My name is Sholo. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in another episode. Ciao.